Australian dollar against US dollar. This week has jumped around. We can see that the price was jumping from this price level 0.659 up to 0.667. So the price could not make any breakout to the upper side or the downside, find the way where the price could go out. So in this case, we can see that the price was forming bullish candles, then going returning back down, bearish candle, then continuing again with the bullish candles and then continues moving sideways. Weekly time frame shows us that the price is currently found a support at this one 0.6626 because currently I have moved this line on the weekly time frame a little bit down so it is in line with where the price is touching as a support and resistance level. Before that it was a little bit up so in this case I have moved where so we can see where the price is crossing and it is preventing the price from falling even more down. In this case, monthly time frame shows us that this month has been closed as a bullish one and it is founding some kind of a small breakout outside of this downtrend channel. So this downtrend channel has been broken on the monthly time frame, which is suggesting further rise in value. Now, based on this one, what we can see, uh, previous month has closed as a bullish and we can see that the price has stopped right here where the critical uh, resistance currently is. This is just only on the monthly time frame. We'll see that much more clearly on the small time frames, weekly and the daily. Very important level was here also 0.66, which has been broken on the monthly time frame and where the next where the next level where the price could stop is very is the top of this week we can see that the price has touched this one so in this case what is uh, monthly analysis showing me that it is showing me that there is a high probability and i am expecting that the price will continue to rise in value reaching this area where the high of this week is currently and after that we will see will the price manage to reach again this resistance level at 0.675 and that is something that we'll see on the lower time frame. Weekly time frame shows us that the previously the price has closed with a bearish, we can see that. And this week the price has continued to rise in value a little bit more, where the price was going down with these weeks and going a little bit up. So this is an attempt for the price to return back down, back inside the Dalton channel, but for the last two weeks the price could not return back below, which is confirmation of the demand zone, which is the buying strength, and there, there is a possibility that the price will continue to rise in value. 0 0.669 is the next level that needs to be broken on the weekly time frame in order to continue to rise for the next one, and the next one is between this one, 0 0.673 and 0 0.674. It is an area 0 0.675, very close to this uh, resistance level. The daily time frame shows us this, that the price is currently jumping between these two price levels and we can see that the price is trying to make a breakout to the upside where the price is uh, trying and it is forming these higher wicks on this side. But we do not have, we should not rule out also this second part and that is the bottom side where the price is trying to make a breakout to the downside. Now, for now, this the price is currently above this support level, 0.6626, and above that we can see that the price has in front of it the downtrend channel resistance line, which will prevent the price from falling even more. Uh, that will prevent the price from rising in value, reaching 0.675 as a resistance level. Based on the one, what I can see currently, it is something that we could see the price is jump, uh, that the price could go above. But the first, what the price needs to break is this one here, 0 0.669. When the price breaks above that, which will also break this Dutton channel resistance line, this will be indication for the further rise in value, reaching 0 0.675 as the next target. So below that, if the price returns and close the day below 0 0.660, which is, we can see, a very important support level for the price. This will be indication for the price that it will continue to fall down even more. And the first target will be 0 0.657. And the second one is the area here, a demand zone at 0 0.655. So for now, I am expecting that the price will continue to rise in value based on what I can see on the long term for the weekly and the monthly analysis. So if you would like to check more details, feel free to leave a comment below, uh, below the video. And that is all for this weekly analysis. See you next time and happy trading.
That is all from today's analysis. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any question, feel free to leave a comment. If you like the analysis, click the like button and subscribe. See you next time and a happy trading.